guess where we're at today? We're at Club Sapphire. Let's go ahead and take a look. For all you guys out there, we're gonna go ahead and take a look at Club Sapphire. <laughs> you can only come in if you got money. Real estate, or just have money. You gotta have money coming into Club Sapphire. So let's talk about Club Sapphire here. Three-story home, another three-story. They're big, big three-story homes here. They're putting out a lot of three-story homes. You can see all the way around here, I mean, these, this place is jumping. You got three-story homes popping up everywhere. So you got 1859 square feet, two to three bedrooms. You can get two and a half to three and a half baths. You have a bonus room, deck at master, 509 starting price point, 509,990. You got option B, 511,990. Option C, 522,990. We talked about Sid and Lids in our other videos. You're gonna have a biannual fee for that. On these homes, you don't have to upgrade to. They're gonna come with the house. That's kind of cool, it's pretty neat. But the other thing too, is that you're gonna have a lot premium, anywhere from 5,000 to 46,000. So let's check out the Sapphire, Club Sapphire. Bring your money. So anyways, let's talk about this. So we come over here. Uh, one thing that I don't like about these homes, and let's just talk about this right away. You have no wall between the other house. So this is almost like a townhome. Like if you, townhomes in Summerlin are a premium. Like you got it. People really like, this is the better option or the up, you know, one level up option from not buying a townhome. So. One of the things about this three story is that you don't really have a wall. The other house is the wall. So like if you bang on the wall, I know that that's your garage, but if you bang on the wall or you do something, you're actually damaging somebody else's house. I don't know if I like that. You have a storage place here. Okay. This is the garage. Let's go take a look at the garage. So right when you walk in, this is the first story. Talk about the water softener. You got the tankless water heater right here. Saves a lot of room. Okay, you can also have, this is not a three car garage, but just like in the other model that we saw, a lot of echo. Uh, you can store something here. For me, I have a dirt bike. If you have maybe a big tool chest, uh, maybe you have something going on where you can just kind of put things over here and store them as well. So it's a little bit, a little bit bigger, has a little bit more to offer than just two cars, which is kind of cool. You got a motorcycle, that's your place. Walking in here. You're gonna have the white cabinets. And as you see with all these homes, these three-story homes, they're all custom, they're all seamless, they're all pretty much the same. You have a closet here where if you come in, you can put anything in here. This is your first bedroom. So we're on the first floor. We didn't see our first bedroom on the last house until the second floor. This is the first bedroom on the first floor. Probably, uh, you know, let's say it's 15 by 15, maybe a little bit less. Uh, than that, you got your bathroom here. So, tile, it's like wood tile. You got your coarse countertops, this time it's gray. You're back to the Blanco, right? So, so depending on what model you get, you either get the Blanco or the Delta on the faucets. And then also here you have your backsplash. You got your Blanco shower head. Again, no tub. What you see is what you get. I do like the high baseboards. I've talked a lot about this, you know, for me, that's my, my thing because it just, it, for some of the newer houses or the, the bigger houses, they always put those high base boards. I actually had to put this in one of my houses and it costs a lot of money. So pretty good deal. So you have your, your tile here, your wood tile, backyard. And this is it, you know, maybe a barbecue place to sit, but being that you're, you know, this is not really, I wouldn't even say it's really a backyard. You can put your, your trash can's over here probably. But I mean, right here, it's like you're hitting the next door neighbor's house. I'm not really a fan of that, you know? Uh, I like to have at least a little separation. You should see some of these houses. Vegas is notorious for me. I mean, they're just like, man, if there's a fire, I'm worried because they're right next to each other. In Summerlin, we have over $300 a square foot. I've seen them up to $325 a square foot here in Summerlin. So to get into a place like this, this is a three-story. 
and you're sitting right around 500,000, it's a good deal. Now this, this is a little bit better for me. Um, if I was gonna choose a three-story home, this is probably the home I would choose because nice big open floor plan. You actually have, what I didn't like about the other one, which was the Opal, is that the room was right next to the master bedroom. There's no like real uh, privacy where you have the bedroom downstairs here at the very bottom. Here you have a secondary uh, floor plan, or let's say the secondary level or the second story, where all this is open. Also too, you actually have an island, right? And this is big because this is, in a lot of these homes we want an island to actually have people over. Now this is a little bit more money. We talked about 509. So this is one of the more expensive floor plans, but you got the Blanco, you have the kitchen countertop or the, the island here. You can entertain people a little bit more if you're coming down or you're, let's say you're upstairs or wherever you're at and you're coming over here to eat. You can, you can deal with that. We have GE appliances and this is the cafe. This looks like it's the upscale model for GE, I believe. We'll have to take a look at that. So I'm not hundred percent sure, but this is cafe and this looks like it's a better quality when it comes to the stove when it comes to the oven and the microwave, and then you also have your, your standard GE, you know, uh, refrigerator. Now this is all included in the warranty, so something happens to this. We talked about upgrades. We know that it has soft clothes, and I'm a big fan of this one too, because the handles, right? We want handles on this, for me anyways. Um, I just think it keeps it clean, especially if you have white cabinets, it's really gonna make things dirty if you're constantly like, you know, trying to grab on something. So. This is the pantry, not really big on the pantry. You know, it's not, not too crazy size, but I can say this. Okay, so for all the models I've seen, including the Amber, I think this is my favorite, uh, even though it's a three story. Now, we talked about how hard it is. This is a nice area, open, you got windows. You can actually see the strip from here, right from this dining area. So I really like this one. This is not, this is really a nice, nice little plan. So if you guys, Want more information on this one, man? I'm gonna I'm gonna really highlight this one. This is the sapphire, and uh, I really like it. The backsplash over here does come with it. Let's talk about that a little bit because you got the white backsplash. That's not an upgrade. Quartz countertops, right? We talked about it. Maple oak, 48 48 inch maple oak, and the old faithful balcony. Now, so. The pros and cons of the other house, right? We talked about this. So the pros about this one, we'll look at the, the balcony up there. What I liked about the secondary balcony over there is that you can see all the way over and see the strip. Again, you're gonna kind of, you're, you're gonna be really just focused on the mountains here, which that's fine. I don't have a problem with that, but you're gonna give and take a little bit. You're gonna have a little bit more things on the house part of it, right? Versus if you're gonna have a balcony over there and you're gonna have a full strip view and you're gonna have a view of pretty much the whole almost half to Las Vegas, you're gonna give and take a little bit. So we're gonna head up, this is level two of the, of the Sapphire. So let's go up here, you got a bathroom up here, okay? This is for company, if anything happens, just, you know, basic, you got your Blanco, soft clothes, quartz, everything's custom and seamless and streamlined. And now we're heading up to the third story. If you guys have need some working out and you don't like to go to the gym, maybe you just buy a three story to stay in shape. So I'm out of shape. Woo. Someone speaking of someone in the gym. Right, I need to go. So you got your washer and dryer on the third level. Awesome. This is a three bedroom. You got over here your you know, another bedroom here. And this is cool. You got the cabinets. You got your washer and dryer like we said. Come over here, they have a setup for like a little girls' room which is cool, uh, but it does have its own bathroom. It does have its own sink and it does have its own walk-in closet. Now when we talk about these properties, they're never gonna put the smart hookup for the Wi-Fi, all the internet, everything hooked up here um, inside the actual master suite. They're gonna put it on the secondary room or the room right next to it. Look at this tile here. Now this is a nice tile, this is different. You know, and with this Blanco, or I'm sorry, this is Delta now. So this is actually Delta throughout here. It's just the charcoal Delta. Delta. So let's rephrase all that. We had Blanco in the last one. 
delta is here and delta is throughout the house as far as all the faucets and things. The, the faucets you saw downstairs on the second story is delta. This is delta as well. So I like the dark charcoal myself. I think it's really nice. Um, we're heading into the master suite. Now, a little bit bigger master suite. So I, I like this one a lot better. I really do. And here's the cool thing. So if I'm picking a house, I'm picking this one, right? This one to me, is worth the money for me. Like I'm not saying not buy a house. If you got, if you want to buy a house and be in Summerlin, dude, you got some options. But this is my favorite option because a couple things. So one, you have more room in this master bedroom. You have a balcony here that now has an open floor plan. The only thing is it's cut off on the strip, but at least you can see a nice, room, you know, big size room. As long as they don't put more houses here. That would be one of the deciding factors for me. But again, if I can get this, this might not be here, guys. It might not be here because they may be just popping up homes like they're doing here and it will just, you know, take away that view. So still though, if I'm looking at a house and I'm saying, you know, if I got to choose a three-story home, this might be it. And this is a nice big walk-in closet. We talked about the other walk-in closets. I understand it's smaller square footage, smaller price. But man, pay that extra little bit of money and get just a little, you know, just a little bit more money gets you this, you know? You got the big um, baseboards, you got the Delta. We talked about the tile in the back. This is all like custom, uh, you know, it's that modern, really upscale style tile that they put in here that really pops with the Delta head, you know? So it looks like with these properties, you're either gonna have Delta or Blanco. Right, and you're gonna have charcoal or you're gonna have silver for what it looks like. You got your quartz countertops here. It does look like, yeah, it is white, so it looked like it was an off white because of the sun. But I mean, look, look at this backsplash that pops, man. You know, so guys, this is the Sapphire. If you guys want to make an offer, Key Realty is my company. You have all my contact information below. Also, subscribe to my channel, LV Crib Tours. I'm Dan French. I'd love to work for you and earn your business. We'll see you at the next video.